Can someone track your location using the hidden codes buried inside your photos that you upload online? Any truth to this or is this more scare tactic bull****? Well, actually, it's a little bit of both, but I'm gonna show you what's going on and how to protect yourself. So, what's the problem? Well, when we snap photos with our phones and cameras, bits of info are automatically added to images, which is known as metadata. Most of this bits of information are immaterial to most people. They include things about which camera you use to snap the image, the ISO, the settings, and more stuff that photo editors may need. However, what is also being added are GPS coordinates so that you're able to track back where the photos was taken, which is kind of neat. So now you have your photo complete with all this metadata and GPS coordinates coordinates and the concern is if you take that and then you upload that to social media you're unintentionally revealing your exact location this sounds pretty serious but i still call bull Go ahead and download a free Chrome extension called XF Viewer Pro. It's available on Chrome there's something similar available on Firefox as well and others open your social media and then well let me just show you so the purpose of Exif Viewer Pro is to reveal those hidden codes, that metadata that's associated with each photo that you upload online. And we're gonna use this tool to see exactly what kind of information is or isn't revealed. Can scammers get your GPS location from these photos that you upload? Well, let me show you. Now, I'm gonna to go to my Twitter profile. I'm gonna find an image I uploaded. There's my cute little guy, Finn. Right click on that, show Exif data. And guess what? The only thing that it shows you here is the location and the image size along with the histogram. So no personal information has been revealed here. All right, what about Facebook? Let's go see good old Facebook. Click on photos and I'm gonna select one of the images that I uploaded. There is Carl Jacobs and I, so that's cool for image. Right click on that image and then choose show EXIF data. What personal information will be revealed? Uh, pretty much nothing. Okay, what about sites like eBay? Okay, well, find an image. Right click on that, show EXIF data, and one more time, still nothing. Craigslist, same thing, absolutely nothing. Should we be worried about Instagram? Well, let's go to my Instagram profile, find one of the images, right click, and wow, look at this, the EXIF doesn't even show up. You see, whilst it's 100% true that metadata can contain a lot of personal information, including your location what they are leaving out of this picture is that twitter instagram facebook and others actually strip out that information before your images is posted publicly so by the time the scammers get to see the photos there are no gps coordinates now to be clear not every site works this way which is why i keep the extension so i can double check before i upload any photos to a website also remember when you upload your original images to these social media platforms they initially do contain all your metadata including your location before they remove it are you comfortable with them having this information? Now, of course, it goes without saying that if you give away your location, snapping a photo with a restaurant name, well, that's a different story. You're kind of doxing yourself. But should you be worried about scammers grabbing your metadata and getting your GPS location? Eh, not really. So if you want to be super safe, well, check this out. The simplest solution is just to turn off geotagging on your phone so it doesn't put your GPS coordinates with your images. You simply go to the camera settings. There'll be an option there to enable or disable that. But I'll be honest, I kind of like this feature. I want to be able to see where I snapped my photos. I just want other people to have access to that. So here's what I do. On your phone is simply snap your photo, then take a screenshot of it. Go into the phone's editing software and simply cut off the stuff at the top, the stuff at the bottom, and then you've got a nice fresh image that you can upload with no metadata. If this is too much of a hassle, I hear you. I transfer all my photos from my phone to my computer. I am using Windows 10, so all I do is right click on the photo file, click on properties, then I click onto the details tab. Here you will see all the metadata that is linked to that photo. I click on the option at the bottom which says remove properties and personal information. I then choose to remove all the personal information and now this image is ready to be uploaded. I have the original file still on my phone so I still have the GPS coordinates if I want them. Now if you're concerned about being tracked, check out this video over here where I show you how I tracked someone with just their phone number. Also check out this video over here that YouTube thinks you should watch. Hit the head down here to subscribe if you like this kind of content and I will see you in this video or this video or I'll see you in both. Let's go.